So why don't you tell us what we're at today? Uh, we are doing a Robot Chicken DC Comics 2 special, and uh, this is our RCDC 2 VIP uh, charity uh, art show that we are doing. Boy, right now. I know, right? Um, no, so we're uh, yeah, we're promoting um, helping out the homeless here in Los Angeles. That that matters a lot, and we're it doing does. that, and we're doing that with seahorses, and we're doing that with mini Robot Chicken DC Comics seahorses, which will make sense when people see the second special. Right now, it doesn't make sense, but it'll make a lot more sense after you see the special. I was going to ask you because I was really lost as to why. Yeah, we're actually going to show that clip here tonight, so people will be like, "Oh, now I want to buy these." So, <laughs> so can I? Why didn't you team up with Marvel? Because I like how what's going on with DC Comics these days? Um, you know, DC. I've had a long friendship with Jeff Johns. Uh, little known fact: Jeff and I wrote our very first television pilot together. Uh, oh, what was it? Uh, it was something for Fox back in like 2002, um, so we were writing partners, and then he got a job working at DC, I got a job doing Robot Chicken, and we've just been friends ever since, and we still are. And you go to his comic book store? Uh, oh yeah, we, I mean, we, we go a long way back, but it, it really just was as simple as I was out to dinner with him when he got the, when he got the job at DC officially, um, he was like, you know, we should do something like this. I'm like, great. And it was just that simple. And if Marvel wants to do that and have that kind of call with us, I'm happy, happy to do it. They just have to ask. It's the same thing with George Lucas. George is like, hey, do you want to do this? We're like, yeah, sure. Does he have any power anymore? Um, well, not. I don't know what he's doing now. I think he's retired and enjoying life. But um, yes. So, uh, but that's how the first Star Wars specials came to be. After the things he did. <laughs> what do you mean? He's, oh, the oh, prequel. George. The prequels were great. I love George. He knows what he's doing. Okay. Yes. Agree to disagree. Trust me on this. Well, he's a billionaire, so you can't disagree with he's that. He's doing all right for himself. Yes. Yes. His daughter was on that robot show, though. I don't know about that. I don't know about that, but I do know that Clone Wars was a magical series. He did do that. And then it finally got on Netflix. Yeah, I know. But tell us a little bit about, so what is the art? It's covers with your figures? Um, or what? Yeah, we did a, a series of exclusive covers for DC Comics uh, for the month that the, the special's coming out. So these are all exclusive uh, prints. That's and amazing. Then, um, yeah, and then just everybody who works in uh, the Robot Chicken Puppet set department, anybody on our staff, and including DC Comics artists, all contributed pieces. Uh, are there going to be anything for LA Puppet Month? LA Puppet Month. There are two Robot Chicken puppets that are on for sale uh, for auction tonight, so we'll see. Uh, we have uh, Aquaman and Sinestro up for bidding. Oh, that's very nice. Yeah. And what and what exactly? This is all going for what? Uh, for Turning Point. It's a charity here who helps homeless find uh, housing as uh, as they're trying to rehabilitate their lives. And finally, if if any, if you could rewrite a comic with Jeff Johns, <laughs> which comic would you rewrite? Like anything going on right now? Rewrite. Um, I don't, I'm not going to rewrite Jeff. Uh, I, I would I would write with Jeff, and um, yeah, I would like to do a creator own book with him one day. Who knows? Maybe that's already being planned. I just love that dream of you guys just working together oh, on yeah. that. Oh yeah, we. You can ask him those questions. We have definitely worked together for a very long time.